Trailer tire, how hard is it to install? No? You have seen me installing tires over here before. A trailer tire shouldn't be that complicated, right? It's definitely different than a motorcycle, but I wonder if it can be done at home. So here's the rim. I'm gonna clean it up a little bit and then try to put this uh, on the rim and see what happens. For those people that are asking, why would I do this when you could buy an entire trailer? tire for 40 bucks uh, I don't know I just want to try it didn't go in oh wow this is very different first of all it's tiny so you have no bite on it because that was kind of a bite over there and then you have no, no rim body to help you out I'm just gonna hold it in there and then get another bite over here okay that, that was actually not that hard man for a guy that can install a tire in Five minutes this is definitely not I'm not using the right technique okay so we're bringing out the heavy guns uh, this is a C clamp that I have that yeah I've used it before yeah let's see what's gonna happen am I going to get a tire iron in the face Trying to feel like a ninja who doesn't know what he's doing. Jesus. Okay. Okay. Okay and okay. Yeah, it's, it's all about technique. Now, the problem that I have is that you see this uh, rim is not settled. So, it's not settled on the, on the rim. So, we'll have to see if just putting air pressure in it will be enough. So that's not enough, so we gotta force it somehow sealed. The principle is simple, so what we have to do is we have to create an environment where the gas wants to expand and come out here on the outside, so it creates like an instant pressure inside. How you do that? Uh, you put some carb cleaner in it, so this is normal carb cleaner. How much? Well, Depends now it has to evaporate so it's important for it to to evaporate in there So it mixes with the air so it has something to burn and then So here it is um, when the uh, Carburetor cleaner starts to burn inside it creates gas and Sometimes it just pops and explodes this one was like a slow burning, so it already got some pressure in the tire. And you can see the rim is already settling on the... The tire is already settling on the rim. And it will burn only until it runs out of uh, air. Once it runs out of air, it just stops burning. And then now you could just inflate it with a normal pump. At this point, we're ready to put 60 PSI in it. And uh, this should go on a trailer. Uh, we're gonna check it for leaks be right before that but uh, right now it's sealed <laughs> 